Today we're in Invercargill, New Zealand, this massive two month road trip from the top to the bottom of New Zealand having the best food this country has to offer has brought us to the southernmost city in New Zealand and it's going to be all about pies today. This video is about one of our nation's favourite foods, the humble pie and we're going to be taking you into one of our favourite pie shops in the country. We are travelling the length of Aotearoa, New Zealand to hunt down New Zealand's best food. This New Zealand food series will delve into the heart of our country's food culture. We'll share the foods Kiwis love to eat, explore New Zealand's most famous food industries and gather and cook New Zealand's unique food. In this episode, we take you to Invercargill, New Zealand's southernmost city on Te Wai Ponamu, the South Island. We take you behind the scenes of a local legend, Fat Bastard Pies, creators of New Zealand's most delicious pies. This is going to be a good one. Hit subscribe and get ready for some mouth-watering food. I'm Thomas. And I'm Sheena. And we're chasing a plate. We hope you're hungry. Let's eat. Today is all about pies and pies in New Zealand are an absolute institution. At last count, for a country of 5 million people, in one year 66 million pies were purchased in New Zealand. So that is a lot of pies per person per year. And this is a meat pie, so in New Zealand it's not sweet pies like in America, it's savoury pies. So it's the tradition like the English, the Australians and the Kiwis. So we have a, a rich food culture and amazing dairy and amazing um, meat. So that floods down to the pies. And so it's beef pies, it's chicken pies, it's meat pies. And this shop up here is one of our absolute favourite that we've found in the entire country. But a pie is very easy to find. In New Zealand. I mean, right here where we're standing, I just looked around, I can see four places that I know I can guarantee I'll be able to get a pie. So you never have to go far for a pie in New Zealand. But this here, Fat Bastard Pies, we absolutely love and we can't wait to give you a look at what a pie is all about, uh, all about and how good the pies are here at Fat Bastard. Oh my goodness, check out all of these beautiful looking pies. So they do the whole gamut. They've got seafood, they've got chicken, they've got beef, they've got lamb. So a pie is essentially a pastry uh, bottom. So you can see the bottom of the pastry which is stuffed full of filling and then it's topped with a flaky pastry top. And oh my goodness, these things look so good. We're going to head into the kitchen and see what they're all about. We've been given a behind the scenes tour of Fat Bastard Pies by James Owen. So James is the creator of Fat Bastard Pies and creating the perfect pie is such an art form. We've been learning all about how these pies are made. So we're in the room where the pastry gets made and also some of the filling gets um, cooked up. So this here is the flaky pastry. So the pastry is vegan, so it's a flour and vegetable shortening. And then we've also watched the uh, short pastry, which is the bottom of the pie. So the, the part of the pastry that holds all of the filling get rolled out in this amazing machine. It's called a Thunderbird dough sheeter. And then we've also been watching some of the fillings get cooked up. So it's steak filling, it's been cooking for five hours, and also a creamy um, farmhouse chicken filling, which is just looking so delicious. James is actually just telling us that 800 pies or thereabouts get sold every day here. And that is a huge amount for a small shop. Yeah, hi, I'm James uh, here from Fat Bastard, well, well, creator of Fat Bastard Pies. And um, we started this bakery oh, about five years ago. And our passion really is just to make really good pies and um, just do it properly, like, you know, the old, the old school way. And um, it seems to be working out for us quite well. You know, what sets our pies apart from different different pies is we just we just take care. Um, we make sure the pastry is correct, it's the right seasoned. Um, we just, yeah, we just do everything how it should be done and we're quite proud of that. Oh. 
We've just been watching James roll, fold and rest the flaky pastry and it has to go through that rotation a few times to create that ethereal, light, flaky, really uh, layered pastry uh, top. And that's what I love about these pies. You bite into them and the flaky top is just, it shatters in your mouth and it melts in your mouth and it is, there's just so many layers. The pastry when it first goes onto the, the dough sheeter is the flour and the vegetable shortening. But you can see that the, the vegetable shortening hasn't totally been mixed through the flour. It's still quite lumpy. So it goes through, it's rolled out, then it's folded and then it rests for 20 minutes just to let the gluten relax and then it goes through that process again and again. This is really interesting to learn about. So we've just come into the room where the pies are getting filled. So Troy here has rolled out the short pastry. Um, the short pastry is sitting in pie tins. What I love about Fat Bastard Pies is the depth of the, the pie bottom, I suppose. So it's really hefty. The pastry is almost like a bowl and there's a ton of filling in the pies. So uh, Troy is just popping the lamb filling into these pies and then he's going to um, stick some kumara, which is sweet potato, over the top. This is one of the first pies we ever ate at Fat Bastard Pies and it was so good. It knocked our socks off. Old batch has just come straight out of the oven which Troy is taking out of the tins and something you'll see here there's two left here in these tins look at the height they've got with that pastry just puffing up when it's in the oven and it's one of the things that stands out when we had these pies the first time was just how spectacular that pastry looked on top and seeing them fresh out of the oven like that it's amazing and you've got a smell of this pastry in the air it is beautiful and it's a hive of activity in here so there's things going on in all directions this is so cool getting a real inside look at how famous pies in New Zealand are created and these are some of the best pies you'll find in New Zealand loving watching all this we have now got some pies so after an experience like that we of course have to eat some pies so being in there seeing that whole production of something that is so iconic here in New Zealand was fascinating loved watching the pies getting made from go to woe and now I've got a bag of hot beautiful pies got all of their favorite pies here that they their top sellers let's eat some pies I'm going to start with the farmhouse chicken pie. So this is their most popular pie. Now in New Zealand the most popular pie in the whole country is mince and cheese. So a beef mince with a cheese filling as well. And then steak pies are very popular as well. So I find it quite interesting that their most popular pie is the chicken one. And we saw the, the, the chicken mixture getting made in the giant pot, 60 litres of it. And it looked so luscious so I am very excited to try this pie look at it that height on there that beautiful pastry that we've seen being made and that flaky top oh man oh, oh it's so good so it's a it's a white sauce style pie so you've got this creamy sauce roast chicken in the sauce and a whole lot of bacon in there and you've got that strong flavor from that bacon oh man I can see why that's such a good seller it's perfectly seasoned it's nice and thick but not too thick that's one of the things we love about fat bastard pies James gets the level of consistency in the in the filling perfect the pastry's perfect damn that is a very 
very good pie. Oh. Oh, I love it. I have got the steak and pepper pie to eat. And look at this. So this is what I was talking about. Like the depth of this pastry bottom of these fat bastard pies is awesome. It's like a bowl that is just filled to the brim with filling. And so this is the steak, which we saw being um, cooked on top of that stove top. And James is telling us that he uses chucksut steak. So the perfect type of steak for slow cooking. steak is so good it's got so much flavor and a really strong hit of pepper and James was saying that they tried to take the pepper steak pie off the menu and they started getting hate mail because people were so incensed that they would even attempt to take this epic pie off the menu so they had to make sure that it stayed on and you can see the big chunks of steak in there so good mmm and that pastry, it is really light, flaky, has a lot of flavour. And the third pie we got is their lamb, kumra and mint pie. Now we've had this pie before, absolutely love it. In fact, we've filmed this pie before. We did a very short segment on Fat Bastard last year when we were filming in New Zealand. And so it's been very awesome this year to do a full-on video all about Fat Bastard, what they're doing, how much care and effort they're putting into these pies, learning all about them and getting to show you guys a classic New Zealand pie done at the highest level. These are unbelievable pies and like I said 60 million plus pies a year get sold in New Zealand so it is a lot of pies and a lot of places you can go to get a pie. And when you find a pie like this that is such high quality that you just adore, it's always a bit of a winner. And this pie is great. So lamb, super famous in New Zealand. He uses Southland lamb. So we're in the South of New Zealand at the moment. So lamb from this region. Kumara is sweet potato. Oh. Mmm. Oh, the gravy is so good. Oh, very strong on the mint. That's such a good pie. Oh my god. Mm. So, lamb and mint, classic combo. And that's very strong on the mint. You've got sweetness from the sweet potato or the kumara. That is so good. And these are Aotearoa's best pies in my book. We've eaten here about four times over the last few years. Every time they are just winners. And getting to see the whole business today, how they make these pies from the go to the woe, and then getting to eat them, getting to show you, it is a special day. For what is a very special part of New Zealand's cuisine? The pie, the classic New Zealand meat pie. Best pies in the world in New Zealand. And Fat Bastard, in my books, best pies in New Zealand. Absolutely. Epic.